We all want to be the healthiest and fittest versions of ourselves, and celebrities are no different. While actors notoriously gain and lose weight for movie roles, other celebs just want to be healthier and feel better in their bodies. Here are the most amazing celebrity fitness transformations ever. Miranda Lambert's weight loss was highly publicized. It was even rumored that the singer had resorted to surgery to drop the pounds. But she wrote on her website, I lost my weight the healthy and good old-fashioned way, watching what I eat and working out with my trainer, Bill Crutchfield. I love to eat, drink, and be merry. That's like my kind of last slogan, but um, turning 30 last year sort of kicked it into gear for me to just get a little healthier. So what does she do to maintain that gorgeous figure? Circuit-style workouts. She's explained to Women's Health that she'll alternate running for the length of a song, then walking for a song, explaining, If I put on Britney, I can picture Britney's body, and I'm like, oh, faster. Christina Aguilera revealed to Women's Health, you know, I'm not into deprivation to get a great body or the body that you want. I'm into enjoying life. So what does this iconic pop star do to get into shape? Yoga. Aguilera found the practice when she got pregnant with her second child and began working with Krista Cahill in Venice, California, doing vinyasa yoga sessions several times a week. Khloe Kardashian candidly posted on Instagram in 2017, If you were to ask me five years ago if I ever saw myself being completely in love with fitness and health, I would have laughed in your face. Me, the chubby one? No way. Being fat really saved me from being a whore in life, though, you guys. Being fat and then being married. Like, I respect Lamar because he still likes me fat. Ever since nailing her new look, Chloe hasn't been shy about sharing her triumphs and her struggles, even revealing how her family asked her to lose weight because she was hurting their brand. Kardashian also revealed that going through her divorce from Lamar Odom led her to the gym, telling Health, I joined Equinox and I would go there and put my headphones on and get on the elliptical or the stairs and no one would bother me. As a byproduct, I started losing weight. While many of us might still associate Hilary Duff with Lizzie McGuire, this star is also a mom who finds time to maintain her gorgeous figure despite a busy schedule. Duff incorporates strength training movements like deadlifts and squats with cardio workouts, all to boost her active lifestyle. She told Shape, I have really strong legs. I'm a mom so I can toss my kid around and go hard with him all day long, and I love that. She told Amp Radio of her home base LA, I love that people are healthy here. I love that we get out and hike. I love that we go to the beach on the weekends. As the daughter of rock legend Ozzy Osbourne, Kelly Osbourne grew up in the spotlight. But while many celebs turned to the best personal trainers in the industry, that didn't work for her. I'm not a model. I don't know what I'm doing. What does work for her is a 10-minute workout every single day. She told The Cut, It's also a great warm-up to do before my actual workout. I do half an hour of cardio, then 20 minutes of yoga. It's a great way to maintain if you only have a few minutes. To be called fat and ugly your whole entire life, to now be on the cover of Shape Magazine, it's like the best f you I could have ever had in my life. While Jennifer Hudson's Weight Watchers transformation was well documented, the workouts she'd been doing behind the scenes were not. In fact, she does it all from the comfort of her own home. Whatever you want to work on, that's what you work on, okay? And it only takes like 15 minutes. She explained on The Dr. Oz Show that all you need is your body to get in a good workout, then to decide on a goal and work toward that. Hudson does 25 reps each of air squats, sit-ups, and push-ups. She told Good Housekeeping, I like to exercise now in a way that I never have in my life. I make time for it as much as I can with this crazy schedule I have, so you can too. When you think about it, you think yourself out of it. So I don't think about it. I just say, Jennifer, get up and go. Jessica Simpson told ABC News that she credits a combination of strength training and a daily goal of 12,000 steps to getting and staying in shape. She told Pop Sugar, I walk three miles a day. Eric and I love taking the kids out for long walks in the neighborhood. If we can all own what we love about ourselves, we won't have to have the jealous part. Simpson tries to incorporate strength workouts four days a week with a combination of squats, uphill lunges, and resistance band exercises. But she told ABC she's realistic about her goals, saying, I'm taking it week by week so I don't get frustrated with myself.